Chef here with yet another recipe for you. Oh, it's going to be good. What do we have here? Uh, we'll see if you can identify this meat. I've got these two nice uh, shoulders here of meat looking good. Do you know what those are? Okay, I'll tell you. These are pork shoulders and this is a uh, USDA Select, super nice, super high quality. This one is about two and a half pounds. This one's about a pound, pound and a half maybe. I'm going to show you two ways to cook my two pieces of pork shoulder. And to start that, we're going to make a marinade. So uh, get these knives out of the way here. Uh, I'm going to be using, by the way, a boning knife in the video and a small chef knife here. So to start with, I'm going to grab a, a whisk, make a real quick marinade. So uh, follow along here. I've got about uh, one, two, three, four, five, six cloves of garlic. I'm just going to give those a real quick chop. Uh, they can remain kind of large. Flavor is going to come out. This marinade is going to go at least a day. Okay. Yeah. Oh, by the way, you make a really good marinade and the meat just gets more and more tender. It could go a couple days. It's not going to hurt anything. Prepare it ahead of time so you're ready to go. Garlic goes in like this. Okay. And uh, that's enough right there. Okay, I've got fresh lime. Just going to smash that lime right in. Mm -hmm. Skin and all. Got two bay leaves, they go right in. I've got one tablespoon of Cajun seasoning, right in. Got one tablespoon of thyme, right in. I've got half a cup of burgundy wine, right in there. Uh, when you use wine, it's a good idea to add some sugar, especially for this teriyaki marinade. I'm going to put about two ounces of sugar. You can use white or brown. I've got some uh, super special soy sauce here, a generous amount, uh, two ounces. Got some extra virgin olive oil right here, four ounces. Okay. Got some black pepper right here. Okay. And some sea salt. Uh-huh. Okay, looking good. That's the marinade right there. Oh, yeah, it's going to be good. Now, there's a little chef secret I'm going to fill you in right here. Sometimes when you do this kind of marinade, it's not enough to cover all of the product. So the secret is a really, really expensive ingredient right here. Half a cup of water. Okay, that helps the marinade permeate and penetrate all of the meat. Okay, marinade's looking good. Oh, it smells wonderful. We'll get this out of the way and move on to the pork. Okay, here we go with the meat. Of course, we're going to need a paper towel. They like to put a lot of uh, uh, liquid in here with the pork, which you don't really necessarily want all over your cutting board. So you take the piece of meat, dry it off, Get as much of that juice off of there as you can before it goes on your really nice cutting board. Okay, small one and a large one, same deal. We'll start with the small one here. And you want to use a sharp boning knife. This is a six inch stiff blade. You want to go underneath the silver skin and uh, just remove it like this. For that, we're going to open it up like this. Uh huh. We're actually going to cut it into some chunks so the marinade can penetrate. Uh huh.
bite sized pieces not too big not too small okay this is looking really good right here now this goes right into the marinade cover and refrigerate that so that's the first part of this video right there pork teriyaki marinade part two is coming right up uh-huh Don't forget to click that little like button right down there so that we know you like the video and you want to see more. Share it with your friends. And if you need custom butcher block, counters, table pops, even this end grain, it's oh so nice to cut on. Contact the sponsor. They're having a sale and I know there's free shipping as well. Yeah, that, that is the good stuff right there. Have a great day. I wanted to mention this is edge grain maple. The strips of wood run left to right. It's very functional, very nice. This is end grain maple. The uh, pieces of wood are turned in little squares. We also call this checkerboard look. And it maintains it, repels moisture and water. So that's it. Uh, these products are in stock at your sponsor chefdepot.com thanks for watching